Okay, <clears throat> so now here's how the columns we have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so there's one. Let's fix this first. Let's go over here and transform to a column. Because if given us some default ones, we just kind of want to start from scratch. Column. Column. Okay, one well, next thing we want to do before we wire up our grid, <clears throat> we just want to go down to each one of these guys type and if it's a date or an int set it to a date or an int. So that's an int. That's a date. Status is an int. Priority is an int. Category is an int. Everything else is fine. Okay, so now back up to our grid. So we need 10 columns in our grid. So go over here to columns. And we're just going to add 6 more. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, Six. There's also this thing called the grid builder. I don't really use it. I don't like it. But <clears throat> here you can just have it create the model. You can do it. Uh, not, you know, it's there if you want to use it. There's also this uh, data UI builder. I never use. It's the same thing. <clears throat> so basically, what I start to do is I start off with the text. I just go down and set each one so I know what it's going to be. So this is my ID. <clears throat> this is going to be my title. This is going to be my create date. I'm going to say it's created. Here I'm going to go status. Here I'm going to go priority. Priority. I have a hard time with that word. Category. I'm going to say status description. I'm going to call it status D for now. We'll change it in a minute. Uh, category D. And then here we're going to have priority image. And then here we'll have description. Okay, <clears throat> now for status, we're not really going to show that. It'll be there. We don't need to see it. It's just a number. That's why we have descriptions. So I'm going to go back to text. And I'm going to say category ID, priority, ID, status. Status ID. So I can take the D off these guys. Because these are the ones we're going to show. But we want the other ones there because we may need that data. We may need to use that for something else. <coughs> and then we'll just call this priority. <clears throat> okay, so now we can come up here and we can put in a thing called a data index. So, since it knows what our store is, it knows what our columns are. ID, go over here and put this one on title. Create it. Create date. <laughs> status. It's gonna be status. Uh, priority. Priority, <coughs> category, category, and our status, our true description now, status description, category description, priority image, 
And it looks like we left out <coughs> the descriptor. The actual description. <laughs> we'll just put it right here. And then we'll come down here to... Oh, wait, we got description in there. Yeah, we just didn't put him over here in the... <laughs> just didn't put him over here. So in our store... <laughs> we'll go over here to field. And we'll just add the description. Oh, wait, we have him. He's right there. My bad. He's there. <laughs> description. <clears throat> Back to our data. Ah, oh, come on. You're kidding me. Yeah, there he is. Okay, so the grid is wired up. We're going to stop this one here and come back and clean it up a little bit.